Rob continues to promote his new music using Alyssa Violet, plus Jeffree Star reunites with Gabriel Zamora. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life with your second YouTube roundup, starting with James Charles, because according to Google Trends, he was searched for more than Billie Eilish, R. Kelly, and even Jordan Woods in 2019. Sister James came in third place in the People category, right under Antonio Brown and Neymar. I just want to say congratulations to them, but I can't tell if it's an honor or not. After all, they were only searched so much because of the drama they were involved in. Womp womp. But okay, let's talk about another beauty guru, because Jeffree Star is bawling out of control right now. According to Daily Mail, Jeffree and his boyfriend Nathan closed the deal for their new $14.6 million house in the Hidden Hills community. The same community as the Jenner sisters, Drake, and even The Weeknd. And just to give you a little perspective on how much Jeffrey just upgraded, his old home cost him $3.6 million, which is an $11 million difference from the price of the new place. Adding to this, Jeffrey's fresh crib has eight bedrooms, 13 bathrooms, two guest houses, and a two-floor gym. Damn! And I would not be surprised if Shane upgrades too, considering his collab with Star reportedly earned them a total of 54 million. I gotta start selling makeup, guys. But okay, let's stick with Jeffrey because one of his Instagram stories from yesterday has fans shook. Recall back in 2018, Star had a falling out with Gabriel Zamora after the latter posted an image of himself with Manny MUA, Laura Lee, and Nikita Dragon. They were all sticking their middle fingers up and Gabriel captioned it, bitches bitter because without him, we're doing better. Fast forward to Jeffrey's post yesterday, it seems like he and Gabriel are back on good terms. Star uploaded this pic with a sticker that read, good vibes. Proud of them, but I'd make up with my ex bestie too if it meant to hang out in that new mansion. But okay, Jake Paul made a video and in that video, JP reveals these days is about dating Alyssa Violet when he began to blow up on Vine and she was still living in Ohio. He talks about the things that they went through, trying to put their pride aside and asking for forgiveness. However, the most surprising reveal comes from the random strangers who got to hear the song early because apparently Jake's music is comparable to Black and Drake. But all right, hit the sub, like, and bell button, comment if you actually bumped Jake Paul's music and then follow me on social media at Ali Stagnita.